geography forest factors like temperature moisture slope and thickness of soil influence the growth of natural vegetation natural vegetation can be divided into three broad categories namely forest grasslands and scrubs forest in places where the temperature and rainfall are ideal for supporting the growth of plant life forest grow types of forest evergreen there are two types of evergreen forest tropical and temperate the trees of the tropical evergreen forest do not shed their leaves in any particular season the temperate evergreen forests are mainly seen on the eastern margins of the continents like the USA and south china deciduous The deciduous trees shed their leaves in the dry season as is seen in the northeastern parts of USA, China, New Zealand and Chile. In the drier parts of the East Deccan Plateau of India, Sri Lanka, southeastern Mexico, East Africa and South America, dry deciduous forests are found. Mediterranean This type of forest is seen around the Mediterranean Sea in Europe, Asia and Africa as well as outside the Mediterranean in USA, Southwest Africa, Southwest South America and Southwest Australia. Coniferous This type of forest is seen in the higher latitudes. They are known as taiga in Siberia in India. Such types of trees are found on the slopes of the Himalayas and they have similar characteristics to those forests in the same latitudes in other regions of the world. Grasslands grasslands in areas where there is low rainfall the vegetation comprises mainly of grasses grasslands are divided into two types based on climate and latitudinal zone they are tropical grasslands and 
temperate grasslands. Tropical grasslands The tropical grasslands extended within the area of the Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn in Africa and South America. The main vegetation here consists of tall grass called elephant grass and scattered trees of baobab and wattle. The tropical grasslands are called Campos in Brazil, Lalanos in the Orinoco Basin and Savanna in Africa. In Africa, they are in close proximity to the equator. Grazing animals like wild bees, zebras, elephants and giraffes are found in large numbers in the savanna. These grazers, in turn, are food for flesh-eating animals like lions, leopards, cheetah, hyena and wild dogs. Temperate grasslands The temperate grasslands lie between 40 degree and 55 degree north and south of the equator. They are known by different names in different areas. Here, the temperature ranges between 15 degree Celsius and 25 degree Celsius in summer, while in winter, temperature goes down to minus 7 degree Celsius. Typically, the rainfall in these grassland ranges from 25 cm and 60 cm. Nearly one fourth of the total land area of the earth is comprised of these grasslands. Many animals like lions, leopards and crocodiles and birds like ostrich and emu are found here. The temperate grasslands in different regions are steppes. In Asia, these are seen in China and Manchuria. In Europe, the areas north of Black Sea, Caspian Sea and Hungary comprise of steppes. Prairies In North America, they are seen in Canada and the USA in the region around the Rockies and the Great Lakes. Pampas they are seen in parts of South America like Argentina and Uruguay wells. In South Africa, these are seen on the leeward side of Drakensberg Range. Downs They are found in Australia in the Murray Darling Basin. Tundra This is the region at the poles beyond the Arctic Circle. Vegetation is very scanty and comprises of only mosses, lichens and small shrubs. There is a variety of wildlife including Arctic owl, Arctic fox, wolf, polar bear, weasel and walrus. <laughs>